Hey guys, it's Gary Dean, DetailJuice.com. I'm about to start working on this uh, Porsche Macan. And uh, before I do that, I wanna grab a couple things. I'm gonna grab my, and I know you can't see. Um, so I grabbed uh, some Amec, the antimicrobial everything cleaner from DetailJuice.com. I'm about to start working on uh, just, she wiped down these seats with a another product and she got basically the product in all the nooks and crannies so what i'm going to do uh, the best way to attack this and i know this is going to be pretty cool to you guys you don't need a real fancy steamer in fact you can see it at this angle really well all the stuff in there so i'm going to attempt to steam it out but i'm going to break it down with amec first so as you guys know the amec is antimicrobial so it's going to be killing any bacteria or whatever i love to use amec on the interiors um i mean it works awesome on the exterior but the whole purpose is to uh kill the germs and stuff on the interior like on steering wheels and whatnot so first order of business clean with the amec okay so you just spray it on. I got, that dilution is pretty light, uh, which is really all you need with Amec generally. It's like one part product to like eight parts water. It's a very strong product. So anyway, uh, part of doing this situation is to break down some of what's in there. But I don't carry a steamer anymore. I have this little not so fancy $20 job from Amazon that does an amazing job. I use this stuff on my on my dress clothes and and that kind of thing, but for 20 bucks it works amazing. And so it's not exactly complicated. However, it is out of water currently. I'm going to put some water in it and we'll be right back. All right, we're back. Filled it up with water. And so it just does its own thing. So I'm gonna try to get all that white stuff you see out. You turn it on, it just does its own thing. When you start seeing steam coming out of here, she's good to go. So we just wait for that. It's pretty warmed up. You plug it in, well you put water in it, you plug it in, turn it on, and then when steam starts happening, that's when it's good. Again, not a perfect system. But for $20, you can't go wrong because it will absolutely help you on things like this, like uh, cleaning interiors and that kind of thing. So if you're not doing a whole lot of steam cleaning or whatever, see it started now. You can see it going crazy in there. Woo! All right, let it do its thing. If you're not doing a ton of this stuff, but you want a steamer to do headliners and you know basic interiors, this thing will do the job. massage oh yeah you can feel the heat now when you use a steamer or whatever that steam that heat is actually taking away any protection that you have so you want to definitely go back over it yeah I can see it breaking down that stuff So, give it another hit with the Amec. Just keep going over it until you're satisfied with the results. Uh, she said she went at it with a toothpick and a couple other cleaners. Nothing worked. So we're going to try a little steam. And you can see that the steam already is helping. It's all up in this area too. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hit it with the Amec real quick. And then... Literally just going to hit it with some steam. This is an awesome little steamer for exactly what I'm doing. Or if you're trying to get, you know, your steering wheel clean, this will do an awesome job at that. So just do it till you're happy. 
put it down and then you just want to make sure you keep wiping up all the excess you don't want to flood the seat out with the uh, water from the steam no need to have super fancy equipment to get a great job done that's the bottom line that's what I've been trying to teach you guys for years I have some resistance sometimes some people think you have to have the fancy 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 but uh, the reality is you don't so that looks pretty good I'm gonna go ahead and hit it with the Amac one more time I'm gonna go over it really even with the steamer and that's it it's about all you can do with it so you see running out of water here I mean I can't tell you how awesome this steamer works really works well especially for the price so that's that I'll turn it off and I believe that we got the results we were looking for is it perfect no does it look better yes and sometimes that's all you can ask for because you don't want to go in there with a toothpick and start boring out those little holes and those holes you don't want to stretch those things out uh, if you start stretching the holes out and that kind of thing uh, it's gonna look funny and nobody wants that so this is where we're at and I'm gonna call this part done cuz I don't believe that I can do a whole lot more for it that's all we got that's it and if you'll notice it does look a lot better so you get to a point of diminishing return I don't believe I can get that any better is the bottom line so now I'm gonna probably just go grab some uh, since I made sure I got everything off like with the Amec and the steam I removed pretty much any and everything that was on here for protection so uh, I'm gonna grab some uh, interior force field slather it on there wipe it in and then uh, that parts done so I'll grab that get that handled and then the next step is to remove that transfer right there and then uh, she pointed out this scratch right here uh, where's it at right there see that this scratch is pretty long oh yeah you can see it so I'm gonna grab some uh, infinite finish I'm gonna start with infinite finish and see what I can do with that um, that's it all right I'm gonna grab what I need to take care of uh, this seat uh, now that it's dry you can see it looks amazing all right time to start uh, working on some scratches after I wipe the seat down all right I'm sure you can see that transfer something hit the car and left its paint on this car so it's not a scratch it's just transfer nothing fancy I'm gonna get some uh, infinite finish I'm gonna put it on just the corner of a microfiber this kind of stuff you can remove by hand nothing fancy it's not complicated in fact I would try to do it by hand before you ever even think about pulling out a machine anyway get the product in the microfiber I usually use the thick nap because it'll help with uh, the abrasive ness I guess of the situation so and just literally start rubbing right on the scratch or the transfer just rub it till it all goes away it's like a magic trick rub till there's nothing left causing an eyesore super easy to do anybody could do it and then once everything is gone from that area as far as the transfer switch to a clean side of the towel give it a good wipe and voila no more transfer good to go time to move on to the next step so we're gonna do a similar situation but I'm gonna move you over here to this scratch on the door 
I can, where is it at? Right here. I don't know if you can see that. Right here. Now, I'm going to do the same thing, but I don't believe I'm going to be able to get this scratch out by hand. So I'm probably going to have to hook up the polisher, but I'm going to wipe some infinite finish on it. You always want to use the least aggressive method first. So try to see what you can do by hand. And if it, if you know, seasoned detailers know what they can and can't fix by hand. Uh, this seems to be surprising me. So this is just infinite finish and a microfiber towel, nothing fancy. So rubbed it all in there, worked it all in, clean side of the towel, wipe it. Wow, seems to be gone. Got a little debris left. Well, not debris, but some polishing residue. But look at that. Looking good. Oh yeah, got it all out. Take you off the tripod so you can see for yourself. Now, all I did was wipe this uh, situation down. I had some FR laying around so I did a, just a waterless wipe with the FR but as you can tell no scratch it was a pretty light scratch I was able to remove it with infinite finish I'm pretty proud of that and you also notice that I didn't damage the finish with the infinite finish it looks amazing uh, once this thing's washed she won't even know I did it however she likes to maintain her own car Nothing wrong with that. So all I'm here to do is the big work. And that was removing this, this scratch here, the transfer over on the bumper, and then fixing the, the uh, issue with the seat. So I did wipe the seat down with uh, interior force field. Looks a lot better. I'm actually going to go ahead and hit this spot and this spot again just because you couldn't see it when it dried. So I'm going to go ahead and get that done and we'll be right back. All right, boys and girls, as you can see, it looks amazing and it's pretty much all gone. I don't feel comfortable continuing to scrub. Also notice what the finish looks like with uh, interior force field on it. It looks very natural, not greasy, but looks like most of that crap is out of those holes I think she'll be very happy with that so this is a uh, Porsche Macan S and uh, that is that so like I said I removed uh, the white residue that another product left from those holes uh, and I did that with that cheap steam cleaner um, I will if you guys want to know about this steam cleaner i'll try to get you guys a link or something from amazon it was like twenty dollars nothing fancy but it works really well on jobs like this i generally do not use a steamer um, i'm not a fan of of steam i feel like my infinite purpose cleaner and my amec uh, work just fine I've, i literally have very little use for a steamer um, you'll you'll barely ever use it in my opinion um, maybe you will maybe that's like your go-to maybe you choose to only use steam you can do that that's fine i'm just telling you i personally do not and um i've never never really gotten into it i had the uh, vx 5000 steamer for a while um it's a nice unit um i i never used it so i sold it and uh this this unit like i said i bought it for my dress clothes and it comes in handy for, for these kinds of jobs as well, especially if uh, the customer is interested in, you know, really disinfecting the interior. And so with the combination of steam with that temperature and the Amec with the chemical, uh, you really get a great clean inside and killing all the bacteria and stuff is important. So I got the interior cleaned up. Well, I shouldn't say interior. I got that seat cleaned up for her. I also removed the transfer that was on this bumper right here. It's all gone and then you guys watched me remove that scratch by hand so it's all gone looking amazing 
813-846-4406 if I can help you with your detailing endeavors. Um, I've got so much stuff going on right now. I apologize, I haven't been shooting a lot of videos. I am working on that, as you can see. But uh, with the reset charger situation, the jet ski tours that you know I'm, I'm doing now, um, and the detail business and my other businesses, I, I stay pretty busy. Uh, detailing is absolutely my passion. And you know the product line is something that you know comes from love. It comes from you know my my soul, and um, I develop the products to help you guys. Whether you're a pro detailer looking to make the most money and be as profitable as possible while still, you know, obviously taking care of your customers, or if you're a uh, enthusiast that just wants to take care of their own vehicles, my stuff can absolutely help you out. Um, we use the highest quality raw materials that money can buy. I don't skimp on price, uh, or I should say cost. So sometimes my, you know, it's not as comparable to other lines as I would like, but sometimes you definitely get what you pay for. And when it comes to detailing products, that is absolutely the case. Um, so check out detailjuice.com if you've got questions about my products or any of that just let me know i got a lot of things coming guys uh, detailing related and uh, i'm very excited uh, my brand new uh, marine line will be launching august 1st 2018 uh, which is just in a, a few weeks uh, and i also have my brand new ceram acrylics um, pro hybrid line uh, which has four products in it which is the coating uh, the spray coating and then there's a rinseless wash and a, a, a shampoo. Uh, both the rinseless wash and shampoo are protective products. So, uh, but anyway, check out the site. If you got questions, let me know. If I can help you in your detailing endeavors, let me know. Um, also, if you wanna take a jet ski tour of uh, the Tampa Bay area anywhere, whether it's on the Gulf side or inland, uh, I can handle that. Uh, check out Reset Charters on Facebook. Thank you for watching. And this has been a Porsche Macan S. Have a great day, guys.